Dalai Lama 14, The Art of Happiness. Dive into the enriching world of, the art of happiness and find out how the Dalai Lama believes that the path to lasting happiness lies in cultivating compassion, embracing universal intimacy, and fostering spirituality. Understand the importance of overcoming suffering, tackling negative states of mind, and learning to shift perspectives. Throughout this summary, you will discover the keys to a healthier and happier life as well as the power of maintaining positive relationships and developing solid mental attitudes. Cultivating Universal Compassion The Dalai Lama stresses the significance of cultivating compassion, defining it as a non-aggressive state of mind that wishes to see others free from suffering regardless of any personal feelings and attachments. Research has indicated both physical and mental benefits to a compassionate attitude like experiencing emotional satisfaction and a long life expectancy. The most remarkable attribute of a compassionate individual is their warmth towards all others, including strangers. Compassion can be developed by understanding things from others' perspectives and focusing on similarities rather than differences. This reduces anger and leads to a happier life. By cultivating universal compassion, one can lead a healthier and happier life, emphasizing Buddhist spiritual development and lasting happiness. Rethinking Romantic Love The Western perspective on intimacy and romantic relationships can be problematic, leading to loneliness and unhappiness for those who don't find such relationships. However, the concept of intimacy varies greatly across cultures and times, offering a wealth of opportunities for connection beyond romantic love. The key to lasting relationships is based on respect, appreciation, and taking the time to know the other person's deeper nature. By embracing the multiple opportunities to connect with other people daily, we can lead happier lives. Spirituality for a happier life Spirituality is not limited to religious beliefs and can bring happiness to both atheists and the religious. Basic spirituality is about being compassionate and caring for others, and it can be practiced in daily life. The benefits of spirituality range from happier families to better health. The Dalai Lama believes any of the world's major religions can offer people the opportunity for a happier life. Practicing spirituality involves training one's capacity for basic spirituality by challenging negative thoughts and impulses. This summary is just the beginning of discovering how to overcome suffering and negative states of mind. Accepting and Confronting Suffering Suffering is a natural aspect of life, but how we approach it can either amplify it needlessly or alleviate it. In Eastern cultures, people seem more accepting of the inevitability of suffering, while in Western societies, people tend to perceive suffering as a sign of personal defeat. To live a happier life, it's essential to embrace the fact that suffering is a normal occurrence and that you can analyze its root causes to eliminate unnecessary self-imposed pain and misery. Resisting change or persistently dwelling on past negative experiences can also amplify suffering. When you eventually face a difficult situation, a positive mindset is key to overcoming it. Rather than seeking to assign blame or feeling like a helpless victim, acceptance of suffering will allow you to confront it and eventually transcend it. The Power of Positive Habits The Dalai Lama emphasizes the role of positive states of mind, such as love and compassion, in eliminating negative emotions and behaviors. Western cognitive therapy shares similar ideas, where maladaptive thinking is identified and corrected to make people happier. To instill good habits, one needs to understand why change is needed and translate that reason into conviction and determination. It is a gradual process that takes sustained effort, and quick fixes are unrealistic. The Dalai Lama's 40-year practice of daily reminders through prayers highlights the importance of determined efforts to establish new behaviors. The elimination of negative attitudes, feelings and habits requires consistent positive effort. Shifting Perspectives The human tendency is to perceive negative situations as wholly negative. However, most situations contain both positive and negative elements, and it is possible to view them from alternative angles. Shifting perspectives can help find meaning in pain and suffering. 
This requires mental flexibility, which can be developed by intentionally trying to shift perspectives during unpleasant situations. Developing a flexible mindset enables one to see the good in every situation. This approach requires reducing one's value system to the most basic principles that can be applied in multiple daily situations, rather than specific and rigid rules. It takes time and effort to cultivate this approach, but it helps in building a supple mind. Dealing with anger and hatred. Anger and hatred are great obstacles to happiness and can have negative health effects. Simply suppressing them doesn't help, instead, cultivating patience and tolerance through meditative exercises is the correct response. The first step is to build a mindset of inner contentment as stress decreases the threshold of feeling anger. When you feel angry, take a time out to analyze the situation and replace negative feelings with patience and tolerance. Overcoming Anxiety and Boosting Self-Confidence Anxiety, fear, and worry are natural responses to certain situations. However, excessive or constant anxiety can lead to serious mental and physical symptoms. The Dalai Lama suggests challenging negative thoughts that generate anxiety and replacing them with positive ones. Examining the reason for specific actions and realizing that the motivation is proper and sincere helps reduce fear and anxiety. Excessive anxiety is related to poor self-confidence, which can be improved by being honest about one's capabilities and limitations. Low self-esteem can lead to extreme self-hatred, which can be overcome by recognizing the potential for development within every human being. Tibetans contemplate this in their daily meditations, which is why self-hatred is virtually unknown in their society. Combat anxiety and low self-confidence by examining thoughts, motives, and capabilities honestly. In conclusion, The Art of Happiness provides invaluable insights on how to attain sustainable happiness by practicing compassion, cultivating intimacy, embracing spirituality, and developing a positive mindset. Learn from Dalai Lama's wisdom as you explore the importance of transforming suffering, eliminating negativity, and finding the good in every situation. Remember to challenge your thoughts, motives, and capabilities honestly, and strive for self-improvement. Start your journey towards happiness today by embracing the wisdom encapsulated in this insightful and life-changing book summary.